Hey guys, it's RJ the Fed. We're back. Today's December 16th. Gonna be trying up another sample, little 50 milliliter bottle. So let's see what we got. Oh, we got a scotch today. Uh, this is a plastic bottle. This is Johnny Walker Black Label, age 12 years. Uh, believe it or not, we've had some Johnny Walker, but we actually haven't had the Black Label. I think this is their cheapest entry level uh, scotch to get into. My only hope is, is that it's not peated. It smells smoky. Ugh. I'll try nosing that one more time. It smells like butter. A little butterscotch, a little smoke. It's like there's another scent to it, but I can't quite put my finger on it. Let's taste it though and see if we can pull that out. So it's very light and sweet on first touch. As it lingers, as it finishes, smoke. But the smoke is definitely heavier than uh, like the Hibiki, the Japanese whiskey, but lighter than the Johnny Walker Gold Label. The smoke is a lot more balanced. So being a peated scotch, this isn't terrible. Honestly, this is not bad. I would I would actually buy black label over the gold. Uh, the gold's like eighty bucks. I want to say the black label's probably closer to like thirty or forty bucks. So for a twelve year scotch that tastes peated, smoky, this isn't that bad. I'm just not a big fan of smoke. I feel like when uh, when we talk about the peatedness of like a scotch, uh, I don't want to feel like I'm drinking an ashtray. Like I don't want juice that just went through an ashtray into a bottle and say, hey, this is our our whiskey. Uh, that just doesn't sound appealing to me. So. This isn't terrible though. So if I had to pick a scotch that had to have some smoke in it, oh, this is the first one I've tried that's considered a scotch that I actually uh, don't mind. So this is a quick review for the 24 days of Christmas of Johnny Walker Black Label, 12 year age stated. Um, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for the 17th to see what else we got in store.